Pieces of advice from the best man. I have known Sean all my life. I have seen him at his best and his worst. I certainly have the qualifications of telling you what kind of man this guy is. Besides, when it comes to Sean, what you see is what you get. If you're friends with him or a part of his family, you sure know what he's like. Sean is not the type of person who hides his flaws. That's why in my role as best man, I'll tell you some anecdotes that will embarrass him otherwise, what's the point? I'm sure you can also share something about this guy that I don't know and will only end up fighting for the microphone. I have decided to give the couple few pieces of advice. You may think I'm not qualified to give advice about relationships, and you'd be right when it comes to marriage. But I have done my research on this. To prove it, you ask Sean's father. We had a talk just before the wedding. But before I start off, Sean, I know it was an easy decision for you to marry Carla. And why not? I've seen how head over heels in love you were the first time you saw her. I also witnessed your friendship that turned into a romantic relationship that has become an object of envy among your peers, I might add. And that, of course, includes me. I mean, having a woman like Carla in your life is truly amazing. Even I wouldn't let go of someone like her. But the decision to get married is different from raising a family. These are two different things, bro, and that should be the first thing you need to understand. Carla has entrusted you with her life, and I sure hope you respect that trust. I assure you he will, Carla. I'll bet my car on that. Moving on to the point of my speech, the first advice I want to give is for the both of you to maintain your love and affection for each other. Never lose the romance your relationship had in the beginning. At the same time, spend each day as if it's your last. Make every moment count by giving all that you can to the relationship. I know that it's possible because more than being the best of lovers, you are also the best of friends. Remember that you are sharing a relationship that is special. You are now bonded together by marriage. Always respect the individuality of each other. Let each other develop as the best you can be for each other. And last, remember life can be unpredictable. There will be good times and bad times, but when things don't go the way you wanted it, just remember that you're together, whatever it takes. That's what's important after all. So that's my two cents for the newlyweds. I hope that I didn't waste much of your time tonight. And before I do, let me just propose a toast for Carla and Sean. A blessed life awaits a wonderful couple such as you. Congratulations! Thank you for listening to the Best Man Speech Sample. If you like it, please hit that like button and please subscribe to the channel so that you can listen to more such speeches. If you want to get this speech and more such sample speeches and toasts in PDF version for easy reading, please check the description below for the link to the Best Man Speeches and Toasts Sample Collection Book.